Hey guys, how's it going? It's Jewel Tolentino here. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to add text in Camtasia 9. Alright, so I'm here in Camtasia 9 right now. And to be honest, it was a little bit confusing to add text. It wasn't clear right away, but I will show you how to do it now. So when you open up Camtasia, it's going to look like this. You want to head over to annotations and from here you can add text in a bunch of different ways so you can add text with these shapes here or you can just use these last two to add uh, text on your videos now I don't have a video here but basically you would put the text on top of it if you wanted it or just have it separately so the difference with these two, there's like a big ABC and a small ABC, it's just the the size, the size of the font, but even if you put down a small one, you can make it bigger, and even if you put this big one, you can make it smaller. It's just like makes it easier for you and faster if you want it already big. So I'll just show you here, I'll just drag this onto the timeline, and when you drag it on, it's like, okay, it says ABC, now what? Well, to change the text, you actually need to double click on it and make sure that it's highlighted. So it's highlighted right now. And then I'll go, this is a test. And then you can use these to stretch it out if you want. So I want it one line and I'll just put it in the center. And then when you click out of it, then it's, it's done. It's ready to go there. If you decide you don't like this text, you can either click on it and then double click on it here. Make sure that the text on this screen is highlighted so that you can change it. It's a little bit different from the Camtasia 8. You, you actually had to do it on the left hand side and you didn't do it on the screen. You actually now make the changes for text on the screen. So you'll notice that the text size is already really big. It's 96. If you decide that you don't want it that big, you can go over to the right hand side and lower this down as much as you want or go back and make it big. From here you can also change the font. This is the um, the standard font that when you drag it down from the callouts down to the timeline, this is the standard font. I actually really like this font. I've been using it, but you can change the fonts if you want to. And you basically do that just by clicking this. And you can also click here if you want to change the color of the font. So you must have it highlighted first and then it will change, right? Change it to purple. If you want to align it differently, so if you want to align left or align center, this is uh, more applicable if you have more than one line because if you just have one sentence, it doesn't really matter if it's aligned left, middle, or right. You can also choose to have the font like regular or regular italic, bold or bold italics. So this is how you add text, like just text on top of a video. Pretty much your video track would be going in the, the track that's lower than the text so that the text shows on top of the video. Now, show you an example here. If you wanted this, this text with the, the rectangle box here, then you would just drag that on from the callout section to the timeline. And again, you do the same thing. You double click and you make sure that it's highlighted. And you go, this is a test. And you just drag down here on one of these circles and you can make it as long or as big as you want. And then it sizes the text accordingly. And if you want the text to be bigger within that, you just go over to the right hand side and play with it over here. And if you want different styles, you just go to all, or if you want to go to a specific one, you go to abstract, basic, the, the, I was in the basic, but if you go to all, you can see all the different kinds. So they have different colors, which you can change as well. And they have different shapes. So if you don't like that shape, you want a specific arrow, or you want a cloud bubble or whatever. So if you want to change the shape, you actually need to go to the right hand section here. Right now we're, we're focused on the text because it's on A, but you need to go A, annotation properties with that little bubble around it. Click on that and you can change the color of the shape from here. So I can make it this like aqua blue here and you can decide if you want it to be solid or you want it to be a gradient. 
Um, you can choose to make it clear or dark. Uh, you can play around with exactly how you want it to look. So the new Camtasia 9 definitely gives you more features when playing around with text and shapes. Alright guys, well that is it for this video. That is how you add text in Camtasia 9. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Back from the dead.